YouTube channel. So today I wanted to do a bomb cosmetics haul because I have brought tons of stuff from there recently and I thought it would be such a great opportunity to just show you guys what there is like this spring summer and what I've been loving and it just seemed like such a waste not to do it. So this is everything I've brought. Um, Bomb Cosmetics were kind enough to send me a gift set as well. So I will show you that, but like 99.9% .9 of this was all brought by my sorry self. And yeah, like I just, I'm absolutely loving baths at the moment. Like I find them so relaxing. Yeah, I've just been loving them recently. And as much as I love Lush, I know we all know it, like I was probably expected to do a Lush haul, but it's just so expensive. And the amount of baths I'm having, like, seriously, like, I just can't be affording that. So I went for Bomb Cosmetics just because I knew I'd get more for my money, and frankly, they just look and smell incredible at the moment. So this is everything I brought. I hope you enjoy it, and I will pop all links to things I've spoken about down below as per usual. So the first thing I brought was actually I brought today, and it is a Bomb Cosmetics Ripplelicious with Pure Essentials Oil Candle. Now this just looks fantastic. It looks like literally someone squirted like whipped cream in a glass and the smell is just insane. It literally smells good enough to eat. Like I would probably be the idiot who mistakes this as something edible. It's got natural oils in it. It's uh, got pure mandarin and bergamot essential oils and it will burn for 30 to 35 hours, which is actually a really good burn time. And I always find that Bomb Cosmetics candles do last a really long time, even like the small tin ones. So, I definitely loved this. I saw it and just thought, oh God, this looks incredible, but I, you know what's gonna happen. I'm not gonna burn it because it looks so beautiful, but I need to because it smells even better than it looks. So let me know if you've had these candles before and whether they're good or not, because I just thought it looked so pretty not to get it. Like just for the look of it, it's perfect for me. Okay, next of all, I will show you what Von Cosmetics kindly sent me. It was a little gift set with all of their summer things on. And the gift set is called Three Little Birds, this one. Um, so I'll open it up for you and show you what's inside. But I love the wrapping paper as it is already. It's really cute, nice to someone's birthday. Okay, so first of all, we've got this nice green soap. Uh, smells very fresh, doesn't smell like apples. I thought it would, but it doesn't. Um, I'm not a massive fan of soaps personally. There's a little diddy little cupcake. So I presume you just chuck this in the bath and it's um, a bit like a bath bomb. Then we have a pretty flower bath bomb. It's got like green sprinkles on it. Oh, I don't know which one this one is. I haven't seen this one before. So this one has got like a pink swirl with a butterfly in and a leaf it looks like. So another greeny one. So there was quite a green and pink theme to this box. And last but not least, a, another small little cupcake little bath bomb. I love those gift sets just because they like, it's a great variety for someone who loves baths like me, cause you've got things like soaps, little bath bombs, big bath bombs. So if you are looking for gifts to people, they are always great to get. I don't even think they're that expensive. I think the ones I brought before were like 12 pounds, I think. Don't quote me. Do not quote me, but I think it's like 12 pounds. They're really not that expensive at all. And they're great gifts to give people. Then I also got a, another candle and it's the new Paradise Lost candle. Like, of course I was gonna buy it because it says Paradise on it. <laughs> um, if you don't know, that's my favorite Coldplay song and I have it tattooed on me. Um, smells divine, smells very floral, not sweet, but floral, extremely floral this one. I wouldn't, it's not my normal scent I'd normally go for, but I just loved the color. It's got some pretty hearts in there and I just loved the packaging. And the smell was a bonus, really. <laughs> I always say that, I always go for the look over the smell and that's like the stupidest thing when buying candles, but I've just got an issue. I've got an issue with candles. Right, then the other three I brought, oh, actually I think I've got the same one as the, one I got in my gift set, so it's called Flutterby Butterfly, how cute. And it has got a little butterfly on there with a leaf, very green. Um, then I got Apple and Raspberry Swirl. Oh, I've got that one too. Wow, I've doubled up without even realizing. Oh, more baths for me. Oh, that smells gorgeous. And that one's called Apple and Raspberry Swirl. 
And then this one is rhubarb and custard. This was my ultimate fave. I love rhubarb and custard sweets. I love the smell of rhubarb and custard. So for me, this is a winner. Oh, I wanna eat it. I want to eat it so bad. Right, so I'll show you this next gift box I got. Um, basically, when I ordered all my bath bombs, I ordered about like 40, no joke, actually ordered about 40 bath bombs. Stupidly did it in two in two transactions as well because for some reason the discount code um, like would only let me do it in two transactions. So I actually I don't think I paid postage, so I don't think it affected me. But it came in two parcels anyway, and I don't know whether they just felt sorry for me, like stupidly ordering two parcels full of like near enough double um, products. And basically, in one of the parcels, I got this gift box. Um, not sure why, maybe um, if you spend a certain amount they treat you, no idea, but um, yeah, like I literally spent like £20 on each order, so I don't know whether that helps, that may have been an offer, no idea, but it was a lovely surprise when it turned up, so um, yeah, I'll have a look in this one for you as well. Um, this one doesn't actually have a name, this gift set, sorry, can't tell you it, but it's got bicycles on it. So it's got bicycles on it. So the first bath bomb is called Azure Skies. That looks really pretty. It's got some little like seagulls on it. Very sky blue. Reminds me of Luscious Frozen actually a little bit. Um, we've got another bar of soap, which, um, what is in there? Okay, I, to me that looks like seagull poo. Like there's actually like, it actually looks like a bar of soap with seagull poo and it's like 3D. Okay, it's probably not, but sorry, I just had to say that because it does. It really does. <laughs> um, well, it's kind of like a beach theme, so it makes sense to have like a seagull pose soap. That's probably not a good idea. Like, I probably shouldn't work for one cosmetics. I would probably, um, probably wouldn't sell a seagull poo bar. Oh, well. Crazy After Dark is the next bath bomb. It's got a little love heart in the middle. Again, very blue, this box. Then we've got a little cupcake thing with some little hearts in. I love like the whipped cream effect. It's so cute and it just, oh, it's so perfect. And these are so cheap as well. They're like half the price of Lush. I think the bath bombs were literally like two pound each, which is nothing compared to Lush when you pay nearly four pound for like one. Um, and then we've got another little blue cupcake with a little heart. A little heart, a little flower on there. Right, now I've just got more bath bombs to show you. I told you this was a lot. This was a lot. And the funniest thing is I've actually used some, so there was more. Okay, blueberry fun day is the next one. And it, oh, it does smell of blueberries as well. It's got a little um, pink whipped cream with a little blue heart on there. Next one is baby shower. I've used this one. This was really nice actually. It really smelled of like cotton. So if you love like the fresh linen cotton smells like I do, this is fabulous. Oh, I might have this tonight actually. I've got ideas now. It's got a lovely pink sparkly bow on it. Um, this one actually has glitter in it, so be wary of that if you don't like glitter. Cause literally like I had, um, I used one last night and I can't remember which one it was. Oh, it was the bee one. I'm about to show you one with a little bee on it. And I put it in the bath and I literally came out with mermaid sparkles everywhere. And I was finding it like in my hair, on my body. I was like, how can this stick so much? So some of them like do attach themselves to you. So just be wary of that. <laughs> Cotton flower is the next one. I've had this one as well and it smells divine. Oh, I just love the smell of cotton, it's too good. So it's got a little blue flower on there. And the next one reminds me of Twitter and it's called Tweety Pie. It's got a little birdie on there, sat on a little branch, which I think is rather cute. Right, so these ones I've actually taken the packaging off. I think it was when I took photos for Instagram, so I don't actually know the names. Um, so we're just gonna go with how they look and how they smell. Um, so this one's like got pink whipped cream with um, sparkles on. The sparkles again are really nice in the bath. And this smells of cow pole. Oh, it smells of cow pole so good. Oh, I really wanna know what that smell is. I keep comparing stuff to cow pole. It's just really sweet. And this one smells quite sour actually but it's a nice sour and it's got like multicolored 
um, like dots on it. It looks really cool actually. But unfortunately, I thought the dots would do something in the bath. I thought I was gonna have quite a multicolored bath, but I didn't, it was just white. So I was a little bit gutted, only because I wanted the color to do something. Normally with Lush, when you've got color bursts and things, you know, it, you expect it to like be all singing, all dancing, and it was just a bit of a flop really. But it was still nice, it smelt nice. I just wanted it to do more. So I'd like more from that bath bomb, please, Bomb Cosmetics, the one I don't know the name to. But equally, it does look pretty. Okay, the next one is a really cute balloon. And again, it's got the um, colorful dot effect on it. This one I think is so cute. It just looks amazing in itself. Um, I have used this one as well. It's really good, but again, quite a plain bath. It did have some blue in it, definitely, but I just wanted it to do more again because of the colored dots. Like I wanted it to be like, Brah. And it smells very cottony, this one. Um, this one I love. This is one I had last night with all the multicolored mermaid glitter. And it has got a lovely little Mr. Bumblebee on there. So it's got like a glitter all around here. And then it's got a bumblebee in it. And it smells very sweet, very classic sweet bath bomb smell. It doesn't really smell of honey, I wouldn't say but I loved this bath bomb. I had this last night and it was probably the best one I've had in a while. So this is a massive favorite of mine. Then last but certainly not least is this one. So it's kind of got like a honeycomb effect on the top and it's very sort of um, sandy colored and white. This one smells of cotton again. I think they all just smell very cottony. Maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just prone to cotton now. Everything just smells the same to me. Yeah, love this one, it smells really nice and um, yeah, it's really cool because it's actually like a honeycomb effect on the top. So definitely something fun for maybe someone who likes honey or bees, like that would be a really cool thing to get them. Right, so that was my bomb cosmetics haul. It is certainly a lot. I'm looking at it now and I think I have an issue. So I'm certainly not gonna need any anytime soon. <laughs> I well stocked up for all my baths I love so much and I've even got some Lush candles. Oh, I can't say Lush in a bomb cosmetics haul, can I? <laughs> I've got some very lovely candles to go with my bath bombs. So can't wait for that, absolutely buzzing. Thank you so much Bomb Cosmetics for sending me that lovely gift set. That was such a lovely surprise and it just, oh, when someone sends you bath bomb, it's just like the best thing in the world. Like whenever someone gives bath bombs, like they're, they're a keeper. Make sure you keep them as a friend, they're good. So yes, that was my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will um, leave the Bomb Cosmetics links to as many as I can down below, but I'm sure I'll give up by like the 10th one. So um, I did mention the names of a lot of them. So maybe just go back and like, you know, see which ones you like and obviously like just type in the name. But all of them I think are new. I haven't done a haul in about six months. So all of that to me looks new. So hopefully there's a lot of new things you haven't been, like I haven't seen in there, but I didn't realize Bomb Cosmetics live so close to me. I could literally just go to the factory and create whatever I want. I could make my Seagull Poo soap, yes. Let's make this happen, Bomb Cosmetics. Um, anyway, I will go live that fantasy behind camera. Thank you so much for watching my video. I appreciate all your views and likes. I've got a very exciting video next week. It's a collaboration video as well. And um, yeah, subscribe if you're new here. I'd love to see you around and I'd love you to watch all my other lovely videos. And I will see you in my next video next week. Take care, lots of love.